Eto na naman ako. Ibibidak na naman ang aking bunsong kapatid na nagtapos ng cum laude, nagtap na char sa board exam, at ngayon kinukuha na siya para maging guest speaker. Kaya sabay-sabay nating panoorin at ma-inspire sa kanyang speech. Ipinapakilala ko ang aking bunsong kapatid na si Ibet Karil o mas tinatawag namin Niniika. Our resource speaker, Ms. Yvette Caril Carulia, the ninth placer of the August 2023 Criminology Licensure Examination. A round of applause, please. Dream doesn't become a reality through magic. It takes sweat, determination, and hard work. A quote by Colleen Powell. I limited my speech to five minutes. Five minutes and two hours to be exact. Hashtag malayo na pero malayo. Parang balik pa. Malayo pa pero... Again, again. Malayo pa pero... Yes. Malayo na. So, I asked myself, how can I begin? Should I start off by giving my life story? of a young woman who consistently made it to the dean's list during college, graduated with Latin honors, became the class valedictorian in her department, and now topped the licensure examination. But also the same woman who is crying every single time. Yes. <laughs> crying when she got a 74 grade in a quiz in which she prepared so much. Crying days before the graduation ceremony because her thesis was not yet submitted. And crying, literally crying, while answering the board exam question during the last day of the exam. But then I remember, people often say, always go back to where you started. Bumalik ka, kung saan ka nagsimula. Most of us are scared of diving into the unknown, of uncertainty, of unfamiliarity, of not knowing what's going to happen. We are scared that things could go wrong, that things will be uncomfortable, and that things might not go as expected. But taking a leap of faith Taking a leap into the future and throwing yourself into the unknown can be very rewarding sometimes. Every time I cracked the news to my parents that I was included in the distance list, I can see the depth of appreciation through their eyes. And trust me, it was one of the best feelings in the world. Having good grades is your only way to give back somehow. Allow me to give three unsolicited advice coming from your senior or your ate. I will rate this as 10 million over 10 in ensuing my own growth, which I'd love to share with you here and I hope will be useful to you. Number one, dare to dream. See the beauty of manifesting, of claiming. Since I am an advocate of journaling, and I am an enthusiast since I was in elementary, I am encouraging you to put that dream on a paper. Because by writing down your dreams, you give them a tangible form, making them more real and attainable. So, writing down your dreams will help you stay focused, track your progress, and motivate you during challenging times. Number two, pursuing excellence in everything you do. Yes, everything. According to our mother, Taylor Swift, never be ashamed of trying. Effortlessness is a myth. But please, don't get me wrong. I am not promoting self-sabotage. 
I am no perfect. I have also my fair share of lazy days and not able to function days. Been there, done that. Kaya nga ako iyakin. Personally, I firmly believe that all of us are here to achieve greatness, to be the best that we can be, and to shake and move the world. There is nothing more satisfying than overcoming a challenge that was previously deemed insurmountable. Nothing more satisfying than looking back at who you are now and realizing that you have grown much more than you thought you could. To be human is to live to our highest potential. Kahit naniniwala ka na hindi ka magaling, Galingan mo pa din. And lastly, number three, take risk. You have what it takes. All you have to do is to believe, leap, and repeat. Get out of your comfort zone. Say, go for it. If you want to do something, don't let fear get in your way. If you spend your life living in fear, you will live with so many what-ifs and could have been. I will end my speech with a reminder to all of you to not focus too much on grades, that you are already missing out on the true purpose of education, which is learning. Have that mindset that you are burning the midnight oil memorizing and mastering the concepts of your respective career choices to contribute in the community and help others who will be needing your expertise in the future. You are on your way to the future that is calling you to live. God bless you all again. Congratulations and just mabalas po sa inagabos. Alam nyo, ang dami kong nasulat. I wrote down all the wonderful inputs that she gave. Allow me to give a few. Sabi niya, number one, dare to dream. Pursue excellence in everything you do. Take risk. And when the journey towards achieving your dreams gets tough, we always go back to where we started. Thank you very much for inspiring all of us.